What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Off-Road Outlaws. In today's video, we're actually going to go and take out the Magic School Bus. Now I have my name named to this and what we're going to do is we're actually going to go take it on the parkour map. I want to see how good it does since it's big because some of the things on the parkour map you need a huge vehicle for. Go ahead and check this out. Okay guys, so we made it inside of the map. Now let's go ahead and get this started. I'm not going to do the race, just because I don't want to. But we're going to have my speedometer on so I can tell how fast I'm going. So I can know how fast I need to go to jump a ramp. Now some of these ramps on here, you have to go about 80 miles per hour to be able to get over them. But I think this thing jumps pretty good, so let's go ahead and try this. <clears throat> already a fail right off the bat so I don't really know why I think it's because I missed first gear but we're gonna go ahead and try it again we're actually gonna back up a little more now this thing's not very fast you know because it has huge wheels dang that sucks okay so the first part we can't get over I'm just going to go ahead and cheat since I haven't placed anything. Since I haven't lowered the water yet. I haven't messed with this map in a while. Okay, now that was perfect. What about this? Can I do this perfectly? Not too bad. It sort of almost over flips. I almost went over and then had to redo it again. But now this part we're not gonna go too fast on because the fact that it's not that far. If you go too fast, you overshoot it. And once I have the map complete, and there's not gonna be, you know, the water's gonna be deep and everything. If you overshoot it, you're most likely gonna have to respawn. So now you know, don't keep going. <laughs> Ooh, that time I almost didn't have enough speed, but at least I made it. Okay, see now there's two different options that you can do here. You can either continue and go to the right and try and go over all that, or you can go to the left. Now, whenever the water is deep, if you have a normal vehicle and you try and go over this and your vehicle falls between, you know, in the gap between both the pipes, most likely you're not going to be able to make it back up. <laughs> you're going to be stuck. The tires, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go over here. Now, there are pipes and stuff over here, but I don't think I've shown y'all this. Hopefully this thing will be able to make it through. <clears throat> okay, so... There are three different lines. The first line is the barricades. Second line are logs. And then the first one is whatever that uh, the black barricade is with two pipes in it. So the last one is the easiest the first one over to the far left is the easiest one, but it's the longest one. It goes in order, you know? The hardest one is the shortest one, but the easiest one is the longest one. First of all, I gotta even see if I can fit through these. Okay, I can. Let me do the crab dance real quick. Ooh. Okay, so maybe this one might be a little too big for it. Because whenever I did make this, I used a different vehicle. Ooh. 
No! No, we're not gonna be able to make it past this. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go around. And we're gonna take the left side. Now, this right side over here, I think I might take this off. Or I might just put a barricade up here or something. So that way, you can at least get up right here to get your speed. For this side. There we go. It's all about what speed you go. So most of the ramps vary between 45, between 45 miles per hour and 80 miles per hour. So go ahead and jump this. Let's get over here. Okay, so you can see in front of me, there's the wall ride. Okay. Now, the wall ride's not too easy unless you really know what you're doing. And I almost fell off there. Okay, so let's go ahead and just try and do the wall ride. Anyways. Yeah, definitely. I don't. I don't think this is gonna make the wall ride. <laughs> it's not meant for something like this. We'll try it again. Yeah, it doesn't, it just doesn't get enough speed. Yeah, overall it doesn't get enough speed for it. Maybe I can stick in first gear. No. So I'm going to see if I can climb over this. If it didn't bounce everywhere, it just completely turned me around on its own. Yeah, it just likes to bounce. There we go, I made it over. Okay, so yeah, basically once you come over here and you go around, it just really leads. It leads you to a platform jump and then once you pass up the platform jump, then it goes to those pipes. Now most of the platform jumps, you don't really need too much speed. If you hit it, I'm gonna watch, I'm gonna go and stay in first gear, okay? If you stay in first gear, you should be able to make all of them perfectly. Well, not in this thing. See, 40 plus is a little too fast. Okay, so now, we, now that we made it back over here to this platform, I'm going to go ahead and do the last one. Cause just because this is the easiest one out of them all, I believe all the pipes should be the same size. Yeah, see, and this, uh, this thing is definitely a lot bigger. These black barricades. I was able to make it over the pipes pretty good. Okay, now whenever... Ooh, that's what happens when you're distracted and you're trying to talk. Okay, so I don't know how I got stuck. So, since I'm already stuck right here, might as well go ahead and explain to you. So, as you see on all the other ones where you have to travel across them, there is a ramp at the very end of each one. 
So basically what you have to do is you have to jump the ramp and land on that platform over there, which is a bunch of crates that are placed down. And the very first one, you know, it's really easy, but it's a lot longer because you have to go to this one. You have to travel all the way through all those. You have to jump that and then jump the other one. And then as you can tell way down there, on top of my front tire, it's not finished. So let's go ahead and get to the finish here. Okay, so now that we made it over here, we're back towards the end. So we're gonna go ahead and take these pipes. We're just gonna go ahead and finish it. If I don't fall between them. I have a feeling if I fall between the pipes, it'll uh, mess me up too, and I'll be stuck. And just so you guys know, all of the land, all the land platforms that you land on, they will eventually have like barricades and stuff around them so that way you can't fall off the side. I'm not going to make it too hard, you know. Make it kind of easy. And then we basically made it here to the end. Now when you come over here to the end, I added a rock. We'll probably be over here. But I don't think this thing will make it up. Because it looks a little too steep. Never mind. I was able to make it up just a little. Ooh. <laughs> I guess that's good enough for me. So guys, let me know down below in the comments what you think about these new things that I placed in the map. If you still want some more things added into it, please be sure to let me know also in the comments down below. Let me know what kind of things you would like to see in this map, and I will try and get to it and build it if I don't fall off the rock again. <laughs> so yeah, just let me know what you guys want put inside the map, and I'll try and put it in here. <laughs> Besides that, please be sure to like and subscribe and turn on post notifications.